Well, 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 ladies and gentlemen, Call of Duty Black Ops 4 is officially releasing or launching today, and some of you are probably playing the game already. I still have to wait eight hours until I can play the game. As of right now, of recording this video here in Norway, and I'm super, super excited to try the game. Uh, but what I did not expect is that my first video on this game is going to be a little bit of a rant. Because Treyarch made a decision in this game, actually a few decisions that I want to talk about, but they made a decision in this game that really ruins it already for me. Not the entire game, but I really want Black Ops 4 to be good. Don't get me wrong, I'm not just jumping on a bandwagon here to just hate on Call of Duty. Uh, I am just, I really want this game to be so good. And they already made a decision that can't allow me to say that this is the best Call of Duty game ever. I love Black Ops 3. I want a Black Ops 4 to be my new favorite COD. Uh, but already, I feel like I can't say that. And I haven't even touched the game yet, but there's one decision that I just so disagree with and I cannot understand that they've done that already makes me think that I can't make this my favorite Call of Duty. It's already lost that title just because of this one decision. And that's because this decision means so much to me. And as I said, full dis disclosure here, I'm not wanting to hate on this game. I want it to be good, but I want to address this because it's just super annoying. Maybe they will fix it down the road, but I feel like this is something that needs to be there on day one. And it's really frustrating. So, um, they literally meant it when they said, forget all you know. Because uh, they t totally forgot something, a staple of the Black Ops series. And let me just bring it out there. Let me explain so you, you understand what I'm talking about. Uh, the Black Ops series is my favorite Call of Duty series, and each game, in my opinion, has improved in some form of way. Like the maps, the kill streaks, the guns have just gotten better and more fun. My favorite kind of streaks is like a UAV, uh, the counter UAV. I love the advanced uh, UAV or the Hater, Blackbird, or VSAT, whatever you want to call it. The dogs, uh, the raps and swore like they just became better and better and better even in black ops 3 they still like came out with cool kill streaks but in this game they kind of dropped the ball in my opinion the kill streaks are not there's none of the kill streaks that i'm super excited about and in each black ops game you always had that streak that runs around and kills enemies for you like the dogs in black ops 1 dogs as well in black ops 2 with the swarm and in black ops 3 we had the raps i love those kind of streaks and they brought it kind of back in black ops 4 but with the strike team the most boring uninspired version of the dogs i am not a fan of the strike team but at least we got a streak like that so that's fine same with the mothership uh in this game or the gunship very similar to black ops 3 not really exciting for me i love the chopper gunner in black ops 1 and black ops 2 those were amazing they kind of went back a little bit on that as well and the thing that really, really pisses me off, remember, this is a game that's supposed to be set between Black Ops 2 and Black Ops 3. What are the staples for the Black Ops series? Well, every single Black Ops game has some sort of a new town. That will happen in this game, right? But in every single Black Ops game, we always had a Blackbird, Orbital VSAT, or a Hater in Black Ops 3. Where is this kill streak or score streak in Black Ops 4? I... I... Who has complained about this kill streak? They should know that this is a streak we want, we love. I know there's specialist abilities with the uh, vision poles and the dart sensor, but they are nothing compared to the hater. The hater is my favorite streak all over. Maybe dogs a little bit more, but I need that hater. We, we all love that, and if you want to go on streaks, everybody loves the hater. Or the Orbital V set, the Blackbird, whatever you want to call it, and it's been in every single Black Ops game. How can you make a Black Ops 4 that is supposed to be set between Black Ops 2 and Black Ops 3 and not have that streak? I'm super disappointed in that, and just for that reason alone, I feel like I can't say that this Call of Duty could potentially be my favorite game. Because one of my favorite kill streaks of all time, or score streaks, is the Hater, Orbital Beast, or Blackbird. I'm super disappointed. Maybe it comes down the road, but I honestly feel this is something that should be their day one, as every other Black Ops game. Let me know in the comment section if you agree with me on that. Personally, I think so. And the other small disappointing stuff, in my opinion, is the amount of guns. I feel like for each Call of Duty, new Call of Duty, they have less and less guns at launch. And Black Ops 3, honestly, they almost gave us everything in the beta. The only new thing is a pistol, a sniper, and an LMG or two. 
Uh, no more submachine guns, no more assault rifles. They gave us they gave us everything in the beta, and we have to wait for more weapons to be added. They will probably add a lot of new weapons, and hopefully they will do it in a right way, not through supply drops, but I think they've learned from that. But the fact that we have so limited guns at launch is something that I really don't like. Like all the older Call of Duty, Modern Warfare 2, Modern Warfare uh, 1, uh, Modern Warfare 3, Black Ops 1, all of these games had more guns at launch. I don't understand where we keep cutting content I'm disappointed in that and I and I gotta I gotta say zombies looks fantastic blackout is gonna be great I love blackout they hit it out of the park with that but the disappointing part for me this year is multiplayer and I'm gonna play a lot of multiplayer and it's already ruined a little bit for me because there's no hater and the amount of guns like I feel like they've cut the content a little bit and the maps as well yes there's more maps than World War 2 but World War 2 was awful there was only nine maps in this game there's kind of 10 new maps and they've added like or actually is it only nine there's nine or ten new maps and there's the remakes which of course makes it into 14 maps at launch and i like that but remember four of them are already we have played them before nuketown comes later down the road in november i don't understand why it's not already there at launch it doesn't make sense or is it december i don't remember but at least they're gonna put nuketown in later Looks like they changed it a little bit though, it's gonna be a snow version, but it's just some small decision, like they're cutting content and they're taking away things that is staples of Black Ops, like, I don't understand it. I'm super disappointed that we haven't seen any kind of hater, Orbital Beast or Blackbird in this game. And the new killstreak they have added are basically reskins of other killstreaks, just changed a little bit. And in my opinion, they all looked better in Black Ops 3 or the older Call of Duty. So I'm a little bit disappointed there. There's no really exciting killstreaks. And they've added the dart back. Was that a fan favorite? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe some people love that thing if they played competitive Search and Destroy. I'm just a little bit disappointed. I feel like Black Ops 4 didn't raise the bar. Uh, they kind of just cut it a little bit back. And I haven't even touched the game yet, but I already know for a fact that making this game my favorite multiplayer experience is gonna already be hard because I'm missing my favorite kill streak, score streak of all time. I wanna love this game, I'm gonna play the shit out of it, out of it. Blackout is gonna be amazing, Zombies is gonna be amazing based on what I've seen so far, but multiplayer has already disappointed me and I haven't even touched the game. Let me know what you think down in the comment section, drop a like if you agree or if you don't agree, let me know why down below. Thank you so much for watching and subscribe if you want more content. Black Ops 4 is gonna be covered on this channel, let me tell you. So uh, hopefully you guys are enjoying the game and I'll see you guys again very, very soon. I'm out.